हेलो एवरी वन आनंद साइड सो आई वॉन्टेड टू टॉक अबाउट हाउ टारगेट टेस्ट प्रेप हेल्प मी थ्रू थ्रू आउट माई जी मैट जर्नी फॉर मी टू स्कोर अ रिस्पेक्टेबल सेवन हंड्रेड एंड फिफ्टीन इन दी जी मैट फोकस एडिशन एंड द रोल दैट इट प्ले एंड आई द रिव्यू एंड आई वॉन्टेड टू टॉक अबाउट हाउ इट हेल्प मी ओवरऑल Uh, to start with my with my background, uh, so I am an engineer. Graduated in 2021 from IIT Shibpur. Uh, post which I am uh, working at a consulting firm from last three years, uh, ZA Associates. So the first GMAT uh, mock test that I gave was I scored a 590. It was the previous version of the GMAT that we had, the classical GMAT, and. definitely i had a big big jump to make to get to my dream score where i was aiming some of the best b schools in india and across the world right so that is where i started 590 and uh, during the preparation itself while i was reading you know other people's journey you know uh, going through them uh, youtube videos i figured i came through this target test prep right ttp which not the review that people had felt really genuine so uh that is when i took the trial for the ttp and then finally went in to join the target test prep so i started my preparation from feb of 2024 and i gave my gmat on july 29th 2024 so it took me good 4 to 5 months to prepare and i think target test prep was a was with me uh, throughout my journey the best thing about the target test prep that was the key factor for me to score a 99 percentile or a 715 in the focus edition was its uh the tests you know the different level of tests it had for each of the topics in all the three sections right so i was able to particularly target the weak sections that i had and go and start from the easy sections and the medium and then the harder sections right so it took me you know it took me throughout the journey i uh, started you know where i was very basic in it you know till the point where i was solving the hard questions so i think that over the structure of the course that is there in it uh, the review, the courses the way it teaches you i think it te- you know even if one is not a very very good uh, strong base in that particular subject they can do well there so that was i'll say the key factor for me you know how in the way ttp held me is so when i started preparing for gmat i actually my um, the main problem that i was facing was my accuracy so uh, so overall concept wise i think i had you know going through all the videos and all i had made a strong base for it but i felt my uh accuracy was not coming to be great right so you know so this ttp has the sections where they show you in which particular test how much uh you know correct question that i made right so i made it a point that no matter what i'll make sure that i am not making an incorrect question if i know that answer right so I, you know I, we and the flexibility that ttp provides that i was able to increase the test time limit and then i focused more on my accuracy once my accuracy was sorted i you know uh, slowly reduced the time for the test and i was able to maintain that accuracy in the limited time as well so i felt that was a very key point for me where i was strategically able to find my weakness and then work on it uh, and using all these analytical tools which are present that ttp provides you so i think that is a very very plus point and one and one should always leverage it so advice that i'll give to anyone who is pre- preparing for gmat is don't prepare it like any other random test that as an indian student we prepare right where we go in to solve all the questions which is out there and we try to master it but rather we'll have to strategize these things i feel the level of questions are not that difficult especially for quant and di but uh strategizing it is very very important for example for me personally i felt the concepts were not that complicated but the questions were quite tricky right in some cases i'll 
uh, you know the questions are made in a way that we make silly mistakes right and that is the place where you know if we is that a 90% fight is won so for the advice that i'll give uh, you know to anyone preparing for gmat or an advice that i'll give to a younger self of me who was who just started preparing is focus you know read the question well and strategize things well list down the weaknesses that you have work on them you know take it as a business case study rather than a very competitive exam where you have to solve everything up right so i think that is the beauty of gmat where you'll you'll have to be very self aware where you are good at where you are not very good at to ace it well right so that will be my uh, you know advice to anyone who is preparing for gmat i'll say uh, gmat had been a very very nice experience for me i think i loved g loved the overall experience of preparing for gmat and i think that experience was multiplied multifold with the help of ttp right the uh, courses it provides the way you know you one can see themselves grow you know with the analytics that is present there i think that is super super helpful and i think you know 100% recommended to anyone uh, whoever wants to prepare for gmat i think ttp will be a great great resource for you so all the best for your gmat preparation and good luck